and still talking international trade, the bilateral relationship between Nigeria and China is said to receive a great boost. Annie Daniels reports that the Consul General of the People's Republic of China, Chu Maoming, stated this at the unveiling of Nigeria Canton Chamber of Commerce Limited in Lagos. Culture and tradition are two endowments that play vital roles in strengthening bilateral relations among countries. Two giant nations, China and Nigeria, have over time tapped derivable benefits from these immense potentialities and enjoyed peaceful coexistence for decades. To boost the relationship, both countries have gone a step further with the unveiling of Nigerian Canton Chamber of Commerce Limited, GTE. We are trying to see how we can, instead of import the goods from China, come in and establish the industries here in partnership between the Chinese businessmen and the Nigerian businessmen. China and Nigeria will do a lot of things together. We join our hands. We create opportunities. And that's why we encourage other countries, other communities in Nigeria, to also find a way to encourage investment in Nigeria. The two countries speak with one voice that standard will not be compromised in all the dealings. Nigerians, men and women, they are young people, they are employees of the Chinese factories. They are workers, but they are trained to be performers. The same products that are produced in China and used in the U.S. and so on are the same companies that produce the so-called fake products we are talking about. So it is all about our uh, agencies in Nigeria that are, are responsible uh, to control trade, to make sure that uh, they up their game to regulate the import of substandard goods. Great optimism is expressed at this gathering that the new step will create more grounds to further promote business interests in China and Nigeria, and by extension, the global economy at large. In Lagos, Annie Daniels, NTA News.